In country after country, it looks, it feels as if life itself has been cancelled. In Paris, in Vienna, in Rome. There, they complied with the strict one metre social distancing rule in this queue for the supermarket. With Italy in lockdown, masks conceal what little interaction was left. But the restrictions are about to go much further and much wider. We propose to introduce a temporary restriction on non-essential travel to the European Union. Why that? Because we think non-essential travel uh, should be reduced right now too, in order to not to spread the virus further. UK citizens like these in Benidorm won't be affected by the ban, despite us leaving the EU. You must stay safely at your accommodation or home. They were among the tourists ordered to return to their hotels as Spain battles against the virus. But some were reluctant to do so. It says there's a flu that we just all need to get over. Have a beer. Happy days. Ciao, guys. In the US, there was condemnation of this. Vast lines of returning international passengers at airports like Chicago's O'Hare that some fear may have turned them into coronavirus carriers. I definitely felt unsafe if the government's telling me to stay in groups of less than 50 and keep social distancing. Um, I, that was the opposite. As Slovakia's PM declared a state of emergency, he and his officials did so wearing face masks. Another sobering sight among so many in this truly global crisis. Julian Drucker, 5 News.